So on International Housing Day, they came to see the Housing Minister's deputy, Margaret Shields. Charles Waldegrave and his protesters wanted answers on behalf of the country's poor. Well, I think the, the answer that this government has given you already is that it's extremely committed to more houses, more money for housing, and it's already shown that by nearly trebling the budgets in the, in the short time that we have been in government. Close Up asked both political leaders to comment on the claims in poor New Zealand. David Longy said he was too busy and Jim Bolger hasn't answered. So the Reverend has the last say. This is no longer a place you could call God's own country when 30% of the country is in poverty like this. So what we need to do is to register as a country the disaster that's actually uh, around us and begin to respond to that alarm and do something about it. And that requires political will. It requires political will from both parties. And no party in this country should be able to present any policy to the country that doesn't have it as a basic core the elimination of poverty.